Hi, this is Daniel at DailyStruggles.org. I just wanted to give a brief introduction or an overview of a new feature that's in the Ubuntu 9.10 desktop. Uh, it is Ubuntu 1. It is a file sharing protocol that you can use and you would access that by going to your applications menu, going to internet, and going to Ubuntu 1. This will give you the Ubuntu 1 preferences and whether you're, you would want to show this icon on the uh, uh, upper right hand corner or whether you want it to connect on start when your desktop starts or if you want to set a bandwidth limit so where it doesn't steal all your bandwidth. Uh, since it's already set up, I will close that. Uh, you can go to your places menu to find out where your Ubuntu One folder is or uh, if it's your first time you would want to go to open your local folder and this will show you what files you have on your local that you're sharing. Um, on uh, If I wanted to access what I had on the web it would be as simple as uh, right clicking the icon and go into the web and then I would click on sign in and once I click on sign in it'll bring up the Ubuntu uh, remote folder of what files I have shared so if I see a file that I want want to download, I can download that file by just clicking on it, or I can play it. Or, if I wanted to uh, look at adding more files to that, instead of having to add them to that remote folder or do some fancy FTP protocol or something like that, I would just simply open the folder and drag the file into the Ubuntu One folder on my on my own system, and it would update that simultaneously or instantaneously. Now, if I go back to the Ubuntu One folder, I can I would be able to see this folder or that file that I just added in just a minute because it doesn't take very long for it to uh, update and <coughs> uh, now this does have a for the free usage it has a two gigabyte limit which is a huge amount um, uh, it does have a File transfer rate or file transfer uh, limit. Uh, I don't know what that is. You would have to go to one.ubuntu.com and look at the different types of accounts and determine what your bandwidth limit was uh, for downloads. But uh, Ubuntu One also has, if two gigabytes isn't enough space for you. They also have an upgrade account, which I know they you can upgrade it to 20 gigabytes and possibly more uh, by also visiting the one.ubuntu.com website. Again, this is Daniel at dailystruggles.org, and as you can see, it already finished updating. Um, uh, please come and visit my website at dailystruggles.org and leave some comment and feedback and let me know what you think.